What's going on everybody and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I want to talk about SaaS. Not software as a service, but service as a software, aka AI agents. So let's talk about it. First things first, uh, we've got a $10 trillion knowledge work labor market size. It could be bigger, depending how you calculate it. What I consider as a knowledge work is college degrees, university degrees that AI is probably going to disrupt. Not totally, but mostly. So let's say it is a $10 trillion market for labor, labor market. All right. Most software developers think it's uh, eating software developers one by one. It may feel like it's only affecting the software developer jobs, but in reality, it is way bigger than that. Software development jobs are currently has the biggest impact because the job market is drying and there is less and less hiring. But yeah, AI is definitely eating some of the software developers positions and one of the reason is that software as a service is not the same as before. Whereas before, let's say Salesforce, th those big software industrial complexes, those big tech uh, SaaS businesses, those traditional software are made so that you need a human to operate. Mostly those knowledge workers here that require college degrees. And they're using different software to make productivity better. And that's the thing is that uh, the software SaaS businesses required human to operate. Whereas today with AI and their capability to do functions, this changes everything. So in this new world, we're seeing that the traditional B2B SaaS, and it's actually eating some of the uh, knowledge for labor force. So in this case, the SaaS, the new SaaS here, the service as a software, it is like automation that is um, replacing uh, workers, especially those office workers, you know, those uh, workers who are sitting in the office and they have hundreds of different software, software applications. And soon those workers are not required or needed anymore because AI can do a simple tasks. And this creates huge opportunities for software developers who can leverage AI. You have to have a new mindset of providing a service, a task, instead of providing tool like a traditional business, a B2B SaaS provides. You're not building a software for office workers to do. Instead, you're replacing those uh, knowledge workers or those office workers with service as a software. Imagine like a automation task or a sales rep whose job is to call to the clients or do emails. Emails can be automated with simple tasks and you can orchestrate different operations, uh, AI functions in order to have a, uh, have a task completed. So this creates a new set of opportunities, which is still small, but once you have the mindset, uh, mindset shift, you can look into the opportunities, right? So what I'm seeing is you can replace AI labor in two different ways. Whether it's internal, you do something internally, like office worker, or you provide external services. Some of them 
not limited by, but let's say automation. Uh, you automate tasks, email, uh, I don't know, phone calls, and you can augment uh, different data sets. You can augment some pictures, do some marketing ads. You can do uh, videos and etc. And then there's other services. But the point is, you're about to witness a huge replacement of knowledge work. Me personally, I've done a university degree. Now I feel like useless. Uh, I mean, most of them will get replaced. Some of them will survive. And here is a small window of opportunities that you can take once you have a mindset shift. Just register to Upwork and see different tasks that can be completed. Once you see everything as a service, as a software, then you can focus on building your AI labor. So I'm gonna end this video with this. Knowledge work is getting disrupted, not just developers jobs, and the new or actually the old B2B SaaS is about to die. The old SaaS could never run itself. It always needed somebody to maintain it and to, you know, use it. And today with AI, it can do the task by themselves. That makes the new AI labor force. I'm gonna end it with this. So do whatever you like with this information, but the new AI workforce is coming. See you on the next video. Bye.